Hi everyone, I'm here at Osvaldo Conti at Vocational and Technical School to chat with some students and learn more about Italian culture and the way of life. Hi guys, I'm a reporter from Creative Vibes Magazine. Sorry, I'm late. Uh, it's here 15 and I need to talk to the guy. Nazaro, go and sit down. Okay. Are you drinking an espresso? Uh, yes, I am. One of the best things about Italy is that excellent coffee is everywhere here. You don't need to go to a specific coffee shop just to have a proper cup of coffee. Even the smallest Italian bar has a top of the range coffee machine, knows how to use it and makes great coffee. Italian espresso is two things. The beverage itself, which varies from north to south, and then the ritual that goes with it, standing at the bar while you chat to the barista preparing it. Well, let's start our conversation. Uh, sorry, teacher, it's Mama. Can I go out? Of course, your mom. She shouldn't call you when you're at school. The first thing the Italian mother always asks you is, did you eat? And if you answer no, then she's already running into the kitchen, getting ready to prepare you something. She tells you to bundle up more before going out, even with a jacket, hat, scarf and gloves. She just wants to make sure you don't get sick. She doesn't trust you in the kitchen alone, no matter what age you are. If she hears you make noise in the kitchen, she'll be in there behind you within seconds because she doesn't want you to make a mess or she's afraid that you'll burn the house down. If you tell her you're having a friend over, she'll cook a feast for 20 people. If you don't answer her phone calls, she thinks you're in danger and you'll get a good scolding once you decide to answer her call. Sorry teacher, my mom, you know. Tomorrow is a Sunday, come and have lunch with us. My family will have lunch together. Mom is cooking lasagna. That's interesting. Tell more about your Sunday lunch. Italian cuisine has influenced food culture all over the world and is seen by many as an art form. Coffee, pizza and pasta are usually linked to Italy. But food in Italy is much more than feeding. It's a formal ritual for people who wish to spend some time together. That's why Sunday lunch is much more than just lunch. It is a time together as a family after the weekly routine to relax and spend the day together. The family is an important value within Italian culture. Family solidarity is focused on the extended family rather than the nuclear family idea of just a mom, dad and kids. Italians have frequent family gatherings and enjoy spending time with their family members. Hi guys, good morning! Good morning, my teacher. I'm a reporter from Creative Vibes magazine and I'm here to interview your students. What subject do you teach? I teach religion. Well, I know Italy is a very religious country. Is it true? Yes, religion is very important in Italy. It's a subject at school. There are a lot of different traditions. The main religion in Italy is Roman Catholicism. This is not surprising as Vatican City, located in the heart of Rome, is the center of Roman Catholicism and where the Pope lives. Roman Catholics and other Christians make up 80% of the population. Italy, 22 regions, more than 31 dialects, traditions, customs and popular sayings are strictly linked to different territories, but all these, even so different, are all included in our beautiful country.